So this is a quick video on my thoughts on this clip, a behind the scenes from the new Joker film. And you know what? <laughs> if there was any doubt about this iteration, I think that this, what I'm seeing right here, and my goodness, it is making me really interested in what they have in store. Now, you know they came out with that tease yesterday, uh, just revealing his look, and there was a lot of opinions that were out online. Some people really liked it, and some people, you know, were on the fence, as well as some just plainly not um, being sold on what they were seeing. But my goodness, look at this, guys. I think that this version, if done right, and from what we are seeing right here, just look at how he is Look at how he looks like he's having the time of his life. You know, when he takes off his mask, it's like my work is done. And this is classic, um, a very classic Joker that we have here. I, I feel like it reminds me of that which we have come to know, especially from the cartoons, the 90s cartoons, voiced over by Mark Hamill. And, you know, just the way he loved the anarchy, the chaos, and he was having the time of his life in those moments. So... Goodness, um, you know, I think that the way they've made him up, his makeup, that it is just working with what I'm seeing here. And <laughs> yeah, the comments online are, I've just been reading a few of them and people are like, they're going to buy the Blu-ray, that they're excited for this movie now. And I think that if this Joker just sticks to the classic Joker, you know, the one that we all know and associate with that character, especially what we saw in the Dark Knight trilogy, that was the essence of him. It's not so much the look, but I feel like the essence is being captured here. And I'm going to say this as a by the way, I heard, uh, I read somewhere online, or I think I heard it in a video that this is going to be an R-rated version. And I'm really hoping that it's not. Firstly, because, you know, for comic book lovers out there, I think it's, I just think it's not so great when some are locked out by that R rating from, you know, participating in the conversation concerning the film as well as watching it and enjoying it as comic book fans. And also, you don't have to go R for it to have depth, for it to be fun, for it to be something that, you know, is impactful. I think the Dark Knight trilogy proved that. So that's just as a by the way. But my goodness, look at this, guys. I'm just watching this right now. And I just think that Joaquin Phoenix is just doing an amazing job. And I feel like he <laughs> he's really embodying this character. So, yeah. You know, when I heard they were going to do another version of the Joker, my first thought was, what is DC doing? You know, the continuity was a first issue that came to my mind. But, you know, DC can always get out of that with, you know, how they structure their universes, you know, with the multiverse within the DC. So I think it can work. If this iteration ends up being, you know, the one that stands the test of time, especially within this run of the DCEU or, you know, whatever name they're calling it, I think they're going to want to integrate it in the main universe. And I'm sure they might find a way. Who knows? You know, it really makes me wonder if this version ends up being the standout in this period of time that we are watching the DCEU, what will they do if this is the one that everyone gravitates towards? So that's just the thought I'm putting out there. But guys, let me know your thoughts. What do you think about, you know, what you're seeing here? Jump in the comment section and let me know. <laughs> you know what? I'm seeing a scene where, like, he either put some laughing gas in the train because there are some people in the background who are seriously <laughs> you know just getting into some business there so that is looking very funny he must have done something but yeah that's this is by the way this looks really really fun and yeah i really want to see this film and i'm hoping as i said before it's not r-rated just putting that out there so let me know what you think once more in the comment section um, are you looking forward to this film? Let me know all your thoughts. And also be on the lookout for more fun videos and reactions that Captain Marvel trailer. I reacted to it, so be on the lookout. Check the cards or the end screen for those links. 
And once again, let me know your thoughts in the comment section. Give this video a like, subscribe, it does help out my channel, and I will catch you in the next one. Have a blessed one.